Hey, welcome to my program. And today we're going to be uh, repeating again uh, what I've been saying before is that you've got to set these pressure trolls to their lowest possible setting because this is the way it comes set from the factory. What we have here is a Columbia, otherwise known as a uh, uh, Ithaca, whatever, Utica. Um, this assemblage comes in this box here. I've removed it um, on the bottom here on this, what is called colloquially a pigtail or steam siphon, um, is a cap. I've just put, I've just threaded it in there for purposes of display right now. You got your 30 pound gauge, which is generally useless. And hello. And what we've got here is sometimes the pigtail gets clogged and you've got to rem uh, get a uh, open end uh, nine, 14 millimeter wrench or nine sixteen inch wrench sometimes. And uh, we're going to be getting back to this pressure troll here. Um, it says Residio. Uh, it's Honeywell's new name, I guess. And we're looking at the PA404A1074. Uh, and there's the date code there. So what you want to do is you want to remove or back this screw out quarter inch nut will work there's the cover and there's the rating and you see here a sign that says cut out equals cut in plus differential so this is the cut in and it's set at well, here we are in Baltimore Maryland so I guess they assumed that we were gonna steam crabs or something with this boiler but no we're going to just heat the building. So we want to set this at its lowest possible setting. There's a differential wheel. It's set at one. You want to take your screwdriver, slotted head. You want to turn this screw counterclockwise to bottom that out as low as possible. If this starts lifting up, you've gone too far. So in theory, this should trip off at one and a half pounds. I would recommend that you put your finger here and pivot upwards. You should hear a click. Ah, so I'm pushing down and I'm hearing a click. So this has gone down too far. And so it will not reset. It will not work. And so what we're going to have to do for right now is raise this up. Put our finger. We want to hear a click. Still not there. So we have come across a pressure troll which is not acting properly there's the micro switch there's right by my behind my finger there that little pin coming down on that tab We're almost there and look at that it's almost two pounds before this thing trips off but that's what it says but that's not how it's going to react. Hear the switch, click, click, and you push down and click. So this pressure troll uh, is going to need some work. Um, thank you for watching, and uh, hope to see you on the next one. Take care.